Beautiful. I mean, the lines are fresh and magnetic, crisp, but yielding. I, I've never seen anything look so good. Thank you. It's my masterpiece. May I? I'm John. And this is the So and So Show. Yeah, but this won't be the only show we're on soon. <laughs> That's right, you caught us at the perfect time. We're actually about to record our audition for the hottest new reality competition show. Yeah, we have to take furniture that most people have around their homes and build them into an incredible couch slash pillow slash blanket fort. That's right, we're auditioning for Fortnite. Fortnite. Ah, what a catchy name. Yeah, to get on the show, we have to present to them what we can do with what we have. So uh, I brought some stuff from my house. And I brought some stuff from my apartment. And we're about to craft the most magnificent couch cushion fort you've ever seen. But first, whew, we have to record the interview yeah, yeah, portion yeah. of the audition tape, yeah. so. Because it's not just about what you can do, it's about what you do with what you can do. Okay. You ready? I think so. How okay. does my breath smell? Oh man, it's not bad, but why, your breath doesn't have anything to do with video. I know, but it's, it's just a confidence issue. You know, smell good, perform good. It's very common saying. Okay, fair enough. Here we go, right? Okay. Are you in the shot? Yeah, I think so. Okay, here we go. Hello, judges from Fortnite. I'm John, cut. I'm nervous. It's, Sorry. You do a show once a week. I know. Just calm down, I know. take, I take a breath. Okay. In, out. <sighs> okay. Okay. Here we Sorry, go. Sorry, now remember, you're Brandon. I, yes, I know. Okay. No, you don't have to. Okay. So. Okay. Hello, judges of Fortnite. My name is Brandon. Yes, and I'm John, and we're really excited to be auditioning for your show. Yes, we, we today, we will be using cushions. And, uh, and other things, blankets, and various pillows, and chairs. Yeah, we've been building forts for years now. Yes, and if we win, we're going to use the money that we win to buy season passes to the Silver Spurs Dude Ranch. Yes, they have pony rides every single day. So. Yeah, incredible. Yeah. So, let's get ready to fort. fort! Okay, I'm just gonna set this down, All right? Okay, set this down right here. All right. Okay, great, great. I just want to show them what we're working with. Are you sure we haven't bitten off more than we can chew? Absolutely not. You know, we just have to be creative. That's the thing about building a fort. You use all the pillows and all the, the whatnot to build a fort fit for a king. It'll be easy. Okay. Let's go. Uh, yeah, so when I said this would be easy, yeah. I don't think. Oh! Okay. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. All right. You got, got it? it. Got, got it. Got it. Got it. Whoa! Don't got it! <laughs> no! No! We can't do this! We can't give up! Okay. How you doing over there? It's looking good. Yeah. Wait, wait. Hey. Oh, yeah! Here we go. Yes? Yes! 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 
Yes! Yeah, baby! Whoa. All right. I'm good in here. How you doing? Almost, almost. Whoa. Whoa. We did it! Woo! <laughs> Look at this fort! Yeah! This is awesome! Oh, it's Bible story time with Kellen! Hey guys! Whoa! Awesome fort! <laughs> Thanks, Kellen! That prize money is practically spent. Ka ching Plus, we'll be world famous. I mean, more famous than we are now. <laughs> oh, yeah, you'll win for sure. Way to go, fellas. So, you got a Bible story for us or something? Um, I do, and you know, it's not exactly like this, but it is about building. Oh, looks like I might have some help. Don Slightly here for Ancient News, where we only cover the oldest news possible. Later, Albert Einstein and his theory of relativity. Which reminds me, I need to call my cousin later. But first, a new construction project is happening, and Ancient News has an exclusive interview with the person who's heading it up. We go now to the scene with Moses. Moses, can you hear me? I, I can, but I don't know exactly how this is working. Uh, where do I look? Here? Here. Uh, can we talk about your construction project? Oh, yes, I... It's here, isn't it? Yeah, yes, sir, yes, sir. Your construction project? Oh, yes, yes, uh, the Lord wants us, the people of Israel, to build a holy tent. It's called the tabernacle. Ah, a holy tent. And for what reason? Oh, so that God can live among us. Could there be any greater joy? Huh. And are, are you designing the tent? Oh, no, no, no. And God has a lot of specifics. Show me a pattern and everything. Wow, and who would be working on this project? Well, first, God asked my brother, Aaron, and his sons to be priests, uh, then Bezalel from the tribe of Judah. God has filled him with all kinds of skills. And really, well, everyone will be pitching in. <laughs> wow, that's an incredible story, Moses. Thank you so much for joining us today. Oh, uh, of course. Uh, this way? No, uh, this way. And back to you, Kellen. So God told the Israelites to start building this tent, right? This tabernacle. And God made sure that everyone had a purpose, even giving new skills to some people, letting them use their creativity to... Oh, well, never mind. Breaking ancient news, everyone. How can something be both breaking and ancient? Break dancing, Kellen. Both breaking and ancient. Fair enough. But first, more info on God's holy tent construction. We have one of the major forces behind the project, Bazalel. Bazalel. Don slightly. Ancient news. Hi. So, we've heard the Lord has blessed you with skills. What sort of skills? Well, I can make patterns in gold, silver, and bronze. And I, I can cut and set stones, and I can work with wood. But it's not just me. All the other workers have been really busy putting together everything. Wow. And can you describe the things that you've been working on? Oh, oh. I can do better than that. I'll show you. This is the ark where the tablet of the covenant law are kept. Here's the table for holy bread and its things. The lampstand, that's pure gold by the way. <laughs> the altar for burnt offerings. Oh, also, check this out. 
the sacred clothes for the priests. God has given talent to a lot of seamstresses in our group. <laughs> mm -hmm. He sure has. So it seems like everyone is using their talent to build this tabernacle. Oh, yes, God gave some of us the talent for building and creating things. Some of us are good at teaching other people how to learn new skills. And a lot of people have been really generous, donating the supplies we need to make everything the way God wants it. Mm. It seems like exhausting work. I mean, it can be tiring, but it's also incredible. God gives us these skills to use, right? We just want to use them to give back, you know, to honor God. Actually, if you don't mind, I need to get back to it. A lot of work to still be done. Of course. Thank you for joining us, Bezel L. Well, there you have it. A massive project, but God has given the people the talent to complete it. Next up on Ancient News, millions of digipets have been left unfed. And they're hungry. Back to you, Kellen. God has given all of us gifts. For some, it's the ability to create something new. For some, it's the ability to make people laugh. For others, it's the ability to figure out a problem in a way no one else can. But whatever gifts God has given you, it's important for you to use them, but not just for yourself. God deserves our honor, and we can use the imaginations and creativity we've all been given to honor God. Back to you guys. Thanks, Kellen. He's totally right, you know. About using our talents to honor God? Yeah. How can we do that? Well, what if we win Fortnite and instead of going to a dude ranch, we donate our winnings to a charity? I mean, we're just doing it for fun. We don't need that money like someone else might. Buddy, when you're right, you're right. That is a creative way to honor God. Yeah, what are some other ways? I don't know. Reveal the question. Mm. Uh, the question of the day is, what are creative ways to honor God? Yeah. Well, building a pillow fort can honor God. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you can honor God by loving other people, too. You can write a story to cheer someone up or, or sing them a song. Yeah, as many skills as there are in the world, there is a way to honor God with that skill. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I have another skill I'd like to try out. What's that? Well, what's the best part of building a couch fort? It's building it. And what's the second best part? Destroying it. Yeah, let's go! Until next week, I am Brandon. And I'm John. And this was the so-and-so show. See ya! Yeah. Woo! Woo! Uh, oh, ow, that's wood. Uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, there's a bed over there. Put it under there. Oh, even yeah. better idea. Yeah, let's uh, move the, move the uh, desk, yeah. Ow. Oh. Fortnite! <laughs> <laughs>